I'm Danny Beckstrom right now on your 13 Action News update. Envy Energy issued a public safety outage management warning for the Mount Charleston area. That's because of the high wind and elevated fire conditions. The provider says this will affect PSOM zones of Kyle Canyon and Angel Park. The outage will end tomorrow morning at 9 a.m. It's, it's impacting about 500 customers. Circus Sports is looking to expand to northern Nevada in collaboration with Olympia Gaming's new Legends Bay Casino. Officials say it will include a state-of-the-art sports book for the new property. It's slated to open in Sparks, Nevada and Washoe County in summer 2022. More information on the new sports book will be announced in the coming months. Two locals won big at Arizona Charlie's off South Decatur Boulevard. They took home more than $41,000 over the weekend. One of them won $35,000 early Easter morning by hitting the double progressive in just 32 numbers. The other took home $6,000 by hitting the ace ball jackpot. Congratulations to both of them. Of course, the big weather story today going to be the wind. We're under a wind advisory and a red flag warning for the majority of the region. The wind advisory because of winds to 50 miles per hour in the valleys. For the Spring Mountains, a high wind warning where 70 mile per hour gusts could cause some issues tonight. One of the reasons for that uh, power being cut on Mount Charleston. We expect blowing dust and debris, strong crosswinds, and the potential force body out outages. The advisory does end at 9 o'clock tonight. You see our wind speeds will trend calmer once the sun sets, but peak winds for the day are expected between about 3 p.m. and 6 p.m. So right around that evening commute, and it is going to be gusty out there. The dust could cause some issues as well. The wind will stick around into tomorrow, but not nearly as intense. Breezy for your Wednesday, not necessarily windy. We expect our high temperatures in the mid 80s under a mostly sunny sky. Our next round of stronger wind arrives Thursday. That brings the return of gusts to 40 miles per hour. And that was your 13 Action News update. You can always get the latest news at KTNV.com.